and got turned down as far as I know. I thought oh, maybe he would get um, $7 billion and they say, ah, you only get $1 billion. But I don't <laughs> think that one happened either. <coughs> but um, I think there definitely is something wrong with science because this group exists. 1910, there didn't need to be this kind of group, or Charles Yost's um, old electric spacecraft group, or the, um, um, uh, what's it, the, uh, tes the Tesla Energy Group. Tesla Tech. And if I have, they just changed the, the, the look of it. The Journal of Scientific Exploration, the, only, the place you can still get published if nobody else will take you, so, so um, uh, paranormal. Um, um, PK research, but in the, the turn of the century, you could get things published on, on table tipping and spiritualism, and that seems to only to be um, in the last last um, fifty years that that attracts complete ridicule. So I think the problems got worse and worse, and maybe this group will grow exponentially and be a solution. If, if it's big enough, it can um, win its own funding and, and start um, running its own projects. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, and, um, okay, there's a, oh, excuse me. Uh, there's a, a number of us who are concerned about getting to dinner on time, which is uh, probably going to need to leave right away. It's about close to quarter till six. But we do have time for some questions. So, go ahead. Yeah, really nice talk. Uh, one question I have is, have you run across a paper or anything on studying uh, how long it takes for fringe science to become mainstream? No, um, I th think nobody studies that. The, the closest I've seen is uh, Colin and Pinch Science Sociology. But um, like this, my list here of all of the, the fringe things that turned out not to be fringe, um, I've never seen a list like this. There's a, a couple of things in the one, the one book, um, Hidden Histories of Science. But there's orders of magnitude more than are, are in the, those books, and I would think there'd be a, a lot of work on that, at least from sociologists. But yeah, it, well, it, it seems like it's a generation. Like somebody said, that it goes funeral by funeral. Great. Ten uh, years seems to be one of years. the quanta, but then there'll be 30-year ones. So I don't know if, it, if there's a step or if it's a bell curve or what. Yeah. <laughs> there's a three. Okay, maybe we're talking about three generations for the Big Bang, because this is taking a long time. Yeah, we must have to wait for a lot of funerals. <laughs> but um, um, ten years, it seems, for the, the, the only mildly heretical that once pe there are a lot of people have heard of it, about it. I think it might be that um, the grad students are interested, even though the the um, um, the main faculty won't touch it. The grad students, ten years later, have some funding and they can start messing with stuff and find oh, it was real after all. So that might be the origin of the ten year thing. Well, I suspect the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Great, because the Big Bang is a big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if somebody has to die, then that's um, generations go by. Rather than just I, I would just like to to, uh, to ask you: uh, uh, can, can we get to uh, your speech in, in some form? Oh, I don't know. Was, was we, it recorded? We unfortunately, um, I didn't have the camera, so we got it. We got so, the last half of it. So, oh, okay. So I'm sorry. In, in but, but there's a the, the there's website a is called um, um, Closed Minded Science, oh. so it has a lot of this stuff in little pieces, like. Um, Ridiculed, then vindicated scientific discoveries. Is this, this, this list. Yeah. Any more questions? Questions? Okay. Well, thank you very much. That's a very fitting ending for our conference. Very fitting. Well, that's a good challenge to all of us. Um, just, just as a little logistic thing, we have this room available until eight o'clock. But as you can tell, uh, a lot of the action has left. You're welcome to roam around. If you want to try to make it to supper, you can do that. And uh, have a great time till next year. See you all then. We're, we're done, but you, we no, have a room until 8. Oh, supper. supper is done is at 6. Is it 6 o'clock right now? Yeah, what is that close? Sorry. Oh, it's, four, it's 47. Yeah. No, no, no. You can still you can go to, yeah, you can get there. They continue serving till almost 6. So you can get that. And then uh, I will be back. We will be cleaning up here. So I will be here until by about 7.15, 7.30. So if you have stuff to come back and get, you can. But don't expect to have a whole lot after. But I'd say about 7.30. Okay? Thank you.
it's real. It's real. Absolutely. So everything associated with this this uh, camera is getting um, a little negative things all around. <laughs> oh, weird. Is it, is it, is it, is it, I'm not going to have time for my talk at all. Or these guys are um, that's not like the main yeah. stuff right now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, uh, it, it was started off, uh, the day started off pretty busy, and then it kind of fizzled as the day went, going, went on, and I, I don't, well, that's, that's all for this slide. I feel bad about it, but I hope you'll come back to our office and join us, and, and you have your cool things. We, he was telling me, we didn't talk about this, but uh, several months ago. Oh, if there was no camera, I could have done the. Do you have it here? No, no, it's in my head. Oh, uh, he's got a really neat idea for an experiment, and he said he, if, if he had time, he'd have it, but anyway, hopefully, maybe next year. No, except this, this is the one where um, um, Tesla may have, Tesla antenna that, yeah, Tesla may have killed someone, one of his staff, and then they described um, um, huge pieces of muscle tissue sloughing off of their chest. From this device. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to do it in a demo for us. So this is going to have to build, build the tabletop version. Uh, well, he was he was um, trying to, to uh, um, sorry, no, but I, I thought give wireless electricity uh, as beam power, uh, those two not as um, earth resonance or radio broadcast. Right. 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 So beam power using a, um, not an ionized path. Don't put your hand in the ionized. High power, uh, it's like a, a, a gamma ray sterilizer. Wow. Well, thank you for your demonstration. Thanks for coming. Appreciate yeah, having you guys here. Really enjoyed it. Well, good. And uh, did uh, sure please, keep an eye out. please visit our website. Yeah. And become active and yeah. all that stuff. Absolutely. Absolutely. Are, are you a student? student or? Or? Yeah. Yeah. Are you a physics student or just like uh, this, this paper? Uh, not officially. Uh, not officially yeah. thinking about it. Well, it's a hobby. So cool. I'll, I'll always do it. Very cool. I'll probably never go to I get it. Yeah, well, this, that's great. This, this Glad you could make it. That, um, um, they still want um, people to have an academic position, so they, they, yeah. they don't want just outside. I have a member of this is that. But I should give you a little fact or focus. Okay. Yeah. But uh, mm -hmm. but that I, I think. Uh, So, but yeah, if I, if it, what, what I'm doing on the web is um, trying to get it um, under the general public and also school children. So, because they, they all grow up in 10 years. Yeah, yeah. It's the, the, the witch hunt, like in uh, Massachusetts, right, hunting the witches. They have to have, have somebody that determines, are, are you a uh, proper scientist, or are you one of the heretics? So it becomes very, very important um, to determine if you're conventional or not.